welcome back to engineering graphics class in this session we're going to discuss how to solve the projection of points problem using solid edge v18 software let me discuss question here a point is lying on hp 20 mm behind vp and 25 mm from right profile plane rpp draw its projections and name the side view Okay, first we need to draw xy line as well and then we need to find out which quadrant this point is located. So here it is lying on HP, means it is lying on HP and behind VP. So it is uh, sharing the both uh, quadrants because it is lying on HP, behind VP means it will be either second quadrant or third quadrant we can take it, any of the quadrant we can take it. Because here HP only, because behind VP distance they given, we need to show it in HP. Uh, then there will be no VP role here because it is on HP. So in the both the cases, the HP will be comes above XY line. So either any of the quadrant you can take either uh, third quadrant or second quadrant. If you take the third quadrant, HP will be above XY and VP will be below XY line. If you take second quadrant, the VP we need to write it next to the HP only because here HP we are not getting any distances here, so we will not worry about the a VP. So only the HP will be matters here. And next, after finding out the quadrant, then go to the point and we can take the uh, phantom and the thickness we can take it as 5. And then one point because it is on lying on HP, one point we need to keep it on the XY line and one will be in HP because behind H v, uh, whatever the VP comes, it, sh it should be shown in HP. So we need to mark it here. And then the distance we can give distance between. So behind VP, they give on 20. So take the point and XY line and we need to show the distance 20. After finishing this, we need to go to line, normal line and we can join these two. Okay, this is the front and top view, you can name this. Uh, whatever comes in HP will be the top view. So it can be or any naming we can take it as a B or D. Any. Now I will take D and this one will be D dash. D dash. And then they said 25 mm from RPP. So go to the line. Just draw the X1, Y1 line to get the right profile plane. So you can name this one with a X1, Y1. And then go to distance, distance between, select these two lines and give the distance 25. And then after giving 25, so this point will become, then we need to uh, write the side view. So this one is RPP, but here we are getting left side view. Because RPP from left side we do that uh, we, when we see from the left side in the RPP left side we will become. So first go to the line, normal line. And here wherever HP is there that side we need to uh, write the 45 degree line. So from the intersection point and give the angle 45 degree. Here and then draw a projection from the top view till the 45 degree line and then draw the projection line where the front view comes. The front view comes along the XY line. So we can join that line up to the uh, XY and then go to the point phantom and give the thickness 5 and then place it here. And this will be the side view. We can take this one as a double dash. And all the conditions are satisfied. 